You place a drive belt on a uh, riding mower. This particular one is a Troy Belt Garden Way. Um, the old drive belt broke, and I ordered a new one for like 30 bucks. Basically, the drive belt is uh, makes the tractor go forward. <laughs> Actually, I have no idea. First, I uh, unscrewed and uh, detached the uh, cables to the battery, and then flipped off this rubber rubber thing. And now we're gonna take the battery out. After that, we're going to take out this battery uh, cover. This is hard to do with holding the camera in one hand. And then we have access to the goodies on the inside in there. Alright, next we want to uh, depress the clutch pedal there and uh, pull up on the parking brake. I want to try this without having to remove the deck because that seems like a pain, but it might make it even more harder. But so, anyways, I'm going to uh, remove, lower the blades all the way down so that I have a uh, access in there. All right. all right. Next, I use a jack and I lifted the front of the uh, tractor there, and I put blocks on the front tires and blocks behind the back tires for a little safety precautions. Alright, next we want to remove the transmission panel. So you unscrew the little parking brake thing. You unscrew these things and this panel should pop right off. Ah, uh, better access. Alright, next we want to disconnect the, idle, uh, the idler pulley spring and it's attached to a bracket on the frame here right by the rear tire. Um, that's a pretty tight spring. I wouldn't be able to do that manually. And it says to uh, use a spring puller or a suitable tool, which I don't know if I have either. But I will give it a shot with maybe a pair of pliers or something. Hopefully I don't pull my uh, my tractor off of the uh, blocks. So I'm going to use a, uh, like a dog wire. And then... I'm just going to try to pull on it to pull that spring loose, but probably not while I'm filming. Okay. Now, this is a drive belt that we're installing. This is the blade belt. So basically what I did is I took the center, the center bolt from underneath here where my finger is, and I had to hold a wrench with one so that the center bolt didn't turn the pulley with it, and that was able to drop this pulley down. And then I was able to feed the drive belt, the top one, and then put the blade belt back on. And now I'm going to, after that, I'm going to reinstall that center bolt. Okay, now I tighten it up under here. And then I use this wrench to hold the pulley still. I've got the drive belt underneath these belt guards. And we got the deck belt. Here, so now I have to go up through here and figure out where to get the final end, the far end of the belt hooked up to. Okay, okay, here we go. I took the drive belt from where we put it in the front pulley, and it goes around this pulley, one side of it, and goes around that area, while the one side of the pulley goes this way. And around the uh, fan belt pulley there. So we're going to have to uh, reverse everything and put it back together. When? When? Okay, now it's the final moment. The belt's on, everything's put back together in reverse order of how we fit it apart. So if this thing goes in reverse and then forward, then mission is a success.